Hello, welcome to another toneless landscape oil painting demonstration with your painter in residence. I'm Francis McCarthy and today I'm bringing you a redo. It's a 5x5. Five five. I did this redo back in November uh, and it's its third iteration as a redo actually and I have to say the third time's a charm. You'll see I'm hitting it with some massive glazing. So the idea behind the massive glazing is that we we get lost, we get a little lost, and then we have to find our way home. And in the process of doing so, we've created a tonal harmony and more interest, more chroma, more color, and uh, so on and so forth. And this painting, I think, is very successful. As a matter of fact, I probably have a larger 8x8 version somewhere around. I may give that the same treatment. Uh, we'll see, you know, I, uh, I as I discussed here the little redo is not such a big deal I can bat a bunch of these out in a day um, Because the paint the painting is basically done underneath. I'm just you know making it better and It takes a lot less brain space than say creating an entirely new painting um, However, it is putting more time and effort into a painting that you know, I haven't sold so you know, it's a double-edged sword, but so far I've seen my efforts on these redos pretty much rewarded um, and that uh, I have sold an awful lot of them and uh, they look better, so that's not really a surprise. Um, this painting, uh, like I said, I did redo it once before. Uh, I believe I did the original back in 2012 or so, maybe 2013, uh, probably more likely 2013. That's when I was going through my... 8x10 and 8x8 phase. Um, what else is there to say? Well, today is Tuesday here in New Zealand. It is February 20th. Yay! Another month gone. Next thing you know, we'll be in 2019 and we're all another year older and, uh, you know, just moseying on down the line. Um, I will say I'm very, very pleased with what I did in this painting and uh, that I have sold it. Um, however, I actually still own it, so I won't get into the details of how or why, but um, you know, if it's catching your eye, give me a call. We'll see, um, unless the person that actually uh, put a deposit down on it does come around sometime in the next, I don't know, few months. We'll, we'll have to go from there. Anyway. Um, I am in the studio today. Uh, I haven't done any painting yet. I had a student this morning, so um, that was fun. And well, I did do some painting actually. We did a painting together, uh, but uh, not, not really my own thing. It's just something we're, we've been working on for many months and uh, it's looking really good. We did some glazing and scumbling and uh, uh, actually, you can see the uh, the power of the glaze in this uh, little presentation I'm making today. You can see what a radical shift that made. Um, the painting wasn't bad before, but it's much nicer now. It's got a, a tonal harmony. Um, it had tonal harmony before, but it has more tonal harmony now. And this is the the power of the glaze. You know, you can you could take a very strong glaze and rub it down over almost any painting, and you're into tonal territory. And uh, it's good. I think it's good. I have not done a lot of this on any larger pieces and I very rarely do this on any new pieces because I have of course a plan and I'm following through on that plan. In the case of the redos it's uh, very much a case of things I've had in boxes or uh, you know that were returned from galleries and things and I just got it in my head that I could improve a bunch of them and uh, as you can see, if you followed my channel, I've improved a heck of a lot of them. I have even more. Uh, and <clears throat> I like to present these during the middle of the week as shorter videos because it allows me to focus on the, uh, the, the new paintings over the weekend. And I do get into a new painting here and there during the week as well. Don't get me wrong, but um, Redo's uh, kind of just... Um, I don't know, gives me something to share with you, and they are interesting. I think they're fascinating, actually. Hopefully you agree and uh, are enjoying watching this video. By the way, uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do. Uh, YouTube has uh, put a new restriction on all small uh, channels that uh, we need to have 
over a thousand subscribers to do any advertising. So you may have noticed the advertising is all gone because uh, I'm not big enough to rate. But uh, if you haven't joined, please do. I appreciate it. Click like if you haven't done that already. I appreciate that too. And all you new subscribers who joined uh, recently, thank you so much. I really, really appreciate it. I'll be back real soon with another video. Meanwhile, please take good care and stay out of trouble.